Think about it. What do you really remember from your U.S. history class? Anything? <laughs> There's a teacher here at Arvada West who's making sure that knowledge sticks. Let's meet our Channel 8 super teacher. Mrs. Holder, can I interrupt? Sure. Because <laughs> I already have. <laughs> Hi, guys. How do you know? <laughs> you, the student body, have spoken and it's our pleasure to present Miss Hobler as wow. <laughs> the Arvada West High School Super Teacher of the Year 2011-2012. Thank you, right. everybody. Thank you very much. You so there you go. Much. Thank you. It's the students who choose their super teacher. That's why Sally Hobler's surprise is an emotional one. I guess because teachers don't get recognized very often, so you just don't expect it. Like, I'm sort of feeling it now. It's just really an honor for kids to say, wow, she's really done something. For her to, to get this kind of recognition from, from the students is, um, it's most definitely overwhelming for her right now. All right, I'm gonna complicate your life for just a second here. Sally Hobler teaches U.S. history. She's very knowledgeable on the subject. You had to put the clutch in, shift, put the clutch back in, and shift over again. And her playful delivery keeps her students on their toes. Oh, Joey. <laughs> We're not too Hitler yet, okay? Hitler's in jail right now. Okay, fine. Good place for him. Too bad he didn't stay, huh? <laughs> she is sarcastic, and but it's in a funny way, and she it's all in good humor, and she really knows the information. I can tell that she really has a passion for history. I love it. So if I love it, I hope that they get some of that passion out of it. And she admits her passion is driven partially by logic. I do believe in education and I do believe in kids and I also tell my students that my social security is in their hands, so I want them to be well educated. <laughs> in Hobler's classroom, you're immersed in history beyond the pages of a textbook. Remember, the test we just had, the Treaty of Versailles, the reparations, Germany being thrown into that depression. We basically started pre-Columbus. We just got done with the Revolutionary War, and right now we're learning about industrialization of America. Content-wise, I would put her up against any other history teacher um, that I've worked with in my 22 years. Of. This is about sparking your memory to include information on your list. Any questions? I always look forward to her class. It's always fun. It's always like an adventure. She really helps us to really understand um, the material that we're learning and really make sure that um, you know we're ready for that test. And she also makes it fun. Good job. Give them a hand. Her classes are fun, yes, but easy? No. The homework is hard, and she has a reputation as a tough grader. I am. I am. I work hard for my reputation. <laughs> and even though she's kind of a harsh grader, that's the only way that we're gonna get better. This is Sally Hobler's 20th year in the classroom. 16 of them have been at Arvada West. Ask her how she feels about teaching so many teenagers, and her trademark sense of humor shines through. What about Bart Starr? Let's go back to my era. Who's that? It keeps me in sort of modern culture. I still can't listen to the music though. I can't go there. No. <laughs> she um, is not like any teacher that I've ever really had before. Kids are first, Sally. I think the thing that stands out the most to me is um, how much she, she really cares. Sounds like Sally Hobler can definitely be proud of her history. Somewhere along the line, it has been impactful somewhere in their lives. I've made them laugh or made them cry, not intentionally, but um, you know, that's why you do it. Congratulations, Sally Hobler. You're the Arvada West High School Channel 8 Super Teacher of the Year. Mm -hmm.